Hi, Dylan. Can I see your name and outlet, please? All right. My name is Shakira Edwards with Where is the Buzz TV. Cool. Awesome. All right. Good to go? Yeah. All right. So, um, first of all, so nice to meet all of you. Um, I have binge watched the show. I'm a very, very <laughs> big fan. Um, so kind of just getting started here. I think I'll start with you, the oldest, uh, Mr. Tripp. Uh, let's talk a little bit about your character. Um, again, we follow each other on, on Instagram, right? Totally. So I checked out your Instagram. I'm like, I love this guy. He's so cool. And then I watched the show and I was like, Tripp. Mm, okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So I think Tripp, what's cool about Tripp, I didn't read the book until after uh, we'd finished, after we'd wrapped. Okay. Um, I wanted to just go based on the scripts because I had heard there were some discrepancies between the book and the screenplay, uh, but they're both amazing. And so uh, the way I the way I sort of envisioned Trip initially reading the first few episodes was I want there to be more than meets the eye. I yes. want him to be multi layered, and I want him to still have a good heart. And um, and that's the way I I, th I think that I played it. Hopefully, and uh, you know, and so he starts out, and it's exactly what you think you know jock player gets with all the girls you know popular but people don't actually kind of you know they just want to be around him for like the oh he's really good at sports and stuff like that and then as you get on the line you start to see oh there's a little more to him and he's got a good heart and he, he cares about people and um you know he can be selfish a lot but he he does have a good heart so absolutely and i i can agree with that for sure yeah. and just like you said even off screen um that's that's real, very realistic, right? There's more that meets the eye to your average teenage boy. Always. Um, so getting into you, young lady, yeah. um, I have to ask, because in this show, um, you are so, I feel, level-headed for your age, and you have this innocence about you, but still so conscious, mm -hmm. and then you have your mom, who's almost the wild child. Yeah. First off, how is it having Carrie Washington as your on-screen mother? It's a dream come true. I mean, she's just such... I don't like words can't even describe, you know, just the incredible human being that is Carrie Washington. Um, she was just so helpful, you know, along the way. Something that I truly admire about her is that, you know, she's not just interested in making herself look good. She's interested in making sure that everybody in a scene is up to par and that they're, you know, doing the absolute best work that they can. You know, it was actually like during one scene, um, I was like giving it like in a really emotional performance and she was like, nah, turn the cameras around because the cameras were on her and she was like, do it, do it with, with Lexi. And so even just, you know, for that, she's just so generous and so giving. And then with Pearl, you know, Pearl is so much more than people like to give her credit for. You know, I think growing up, she has always kind of had to fend for herself because later on, you know, you you hear that, you know, Mia was always kind of working late, you know, ever since, you know, Pearl was little. Mia was working late, you know, Pearl had to cook dinner for herself or, you know, she had to depend on leftovers. She's always kind of had to serve as a mother in their mother and daughter relationship. And so I think that's why she's so level-headed when she comes into Shaker Heights, but then she's so easily blinded by all the glory that is the Richardson family. And I think it's easy to, because, you know, when you're trying to find yourself and find your voice, it's easy to get caught up in the facades, which is exactly what Shager Heights is, so. Absolutely, and you answered that beautifully. Thank you. Um, what are some of, some things that you've learned specifically from Carrie throughout the filming of the show? Um, I think the main thing that I learned was how to unapologetically take up space. Yeah. You know, she is, a wife, she's a mom, she's just a boss, period. Um, she is a producer and a fantastic one at that, and she's also an incredible actress. You know, just seeing her, you know, balance all those things at once. And even like on days where it would be like 6 a.m. calls, she would come in and she would like just have this bright smile on her face and she would always, you know, say hi and make it a point to look every person in their eye. Yeah. Because how you come in, it really affects the tone of the work that you know you're gonna do for the day. Yeah. Now your character is Moody, uh, one of my favorite characters, I have to say, <laughs> because he's just so sweet um, and true to himself and really there to uplift others. I absolutely love your relationship with your younger sister, Izzy. Um, do you have siblings off screen? Grace? Nope, you, it's just um, me. All right, well you, yeah. you definitely <laughs> killed it. That brotherly role came natural to you. I have to ask you a similar question as to what I asked her. Mm -hmm. um, playing uh, a child of Reese Witherspoon, a huge, huge, huge actress, um, how was that it was amazing. Um, I mean, from day one on set, and she was telling jokes and making everyone laugh, which was um, it was a great first introduction. Uh, and she was super nice and very supportive of me sort of getting started on the project. And then on top of that, I, I mean, she's won an Oscar. She's incredibly talented. Yeah. Um, 
and just I love how much work she puts into her character is amazing to see and to play off of because you know she gives a different read every take uh, which makes it so much fun uh, yeah she, I mean, she's incredible absolutely well thank you all so much thank you, thank you. Um, I look forward to watching the show unfold more looking forward to some new seasons coming up as well but thank you all you're all so talented thank you, thank you so much thank you thank you, thank you.